so the simplest bird trap so what you'll need is a just a box and you'll need to punch a hole in the top center this is just an old Australia post box you'll also need a mouse trap or a rat trap in this case I'll use a rat trap because it's easier for me to show you but it doesn't matter you'll also need a short piece of string and two large nails and that's it so let's go put it together so you want to start by pegging the mouse or rat trap down to the ground with one of the nails now take one end of the string and thread it through the hole you put in the box and tie a loop in the end so the string has a loop on each end now so so attach one loop onto the rat trap and pull the string until the box is sitting at the angle that you need and then peg that to the ground now take the other loop and put the trigger rod through it and set the mouse trap like you usually would so the traps now made we've, I use the term lightly it's, you're just putting things together that's why I call it the simplest bird trap so obviously when the when you've baited the trap when the bird hits the trigger the box will fall on them and it's as simple as that I used four nails here which was overkill just depends what your soil's like. So I'll reset that, I'll bait it, and we'll see what happens. So this is an Indian miner and I haven't seen one of those around here in years. So that was quite an odd catch and by rights I should have killed him because he's an introduced species and, and also an invasive species. So he'll outcompete the native birds around here. And this is a Karawong which is a native bird similar to the magpie but without some of the white markings and he's free to go and here's some uh, top-notch pigeons which I believe are correctly called the crested pigeon and I'll swap the box over for a laundry basket just to show you that you can use whatever you have laying around anyway before I end this movie um, I'll show you a picture that I have of a trap I made a long time ago 
It's the exact same principle, but it's in a more uh, transportable form. It is small. It only was used to catch uh, sparrows and mice. But as you can see, the string comes up from the trigger over a steel rod and is connected to the front of the cage, which is on a hinge. So everyone should have a mouse trap and a box at their house. So now you can go set a trap on your lawn and tell us what you caught down in the comments below.